How's everything going, guys? It's your man Jeremiah back at it again. I know it's been a minute, but I'm gonna do a quick video on understanding market structure when trading the foreign exchange market or you know if people also trade stocks, just understanding market structure and how the market moves. So as you can see, the market goes, it goes three directions, but I have two of the main key directions that the market goes. So in my first box right here, as you can see, I have an arrow going up and I have a line chart going up into an uptrending market. So how you get this started is basically when the market is going into the uptrend, you want to try to take entry as low as possible. You want to try and get in as low as possible and um, basically just use the market to your advantage. So as we're going up to start it off, we have a higher high. This is a higher high. We have right here a higher high and the higher low. So at this higher low point, it's best for you to get in as low as possible. So once you take a buy position, you're already going up and you're into profit. You don't want to take a buy position at a higher high point. And as soon as you expect the market to go up, the market automatically drops you into drawdown. So you want to always try to get in as low as possible. So the market forms um, higher highs and higher lows in the uptrend. As you can see, if I would have took entry right here, higher high, higher low, took the market up, higher low, higher high, higher low. So in the uptrend, you only take entry at higher low points. And this is basic market structure. And now in a downtrend, when you're going into a downtrend, you want to try and sell as high as possible. So you have a lower low, lower low, and a lower high. And it's called a lower high simply because the market is in a downtrend. It's forming lows, but this is the highest point in this downtrend in market. So you want to take entry at a lower high because when you take a sale position, you're expecting the market to drop. So once the market drops, you're into profit. You don't want to take a sale position at a lower low point simply because you don't want to sell at a lower low. And as soon as you sell, expecting the market to drop, the market will go back up. So you always want to take entry as high as possible in sell positions. You sell high and you buy low. And this is just basic market structure. Higher highs and higher lows on the uptrend. And on a downtrend, you have lower lows and lower highs. One second, let me mark this off for y'all so y'all get a basic understanding of how to read market structure. <laughs> Higher low. Understanding market structure is the one of the most important keys when trading simply because if you don't know where you're at in the market, then you know you'll be lost or you'll blow a lot of money. So it's best to understand where you're at in the market. And the third direction that the market uh moves in is consolidation when the market goes sideways market just goes sideways and you never want to enter the market when it's going sideways because 
you don't know the trend. If you don't know the trend, then how are you to take a setup? You can't take a setup with the market. You can't take a, a buy position down here and expect the market to shoot up and break, retest, continue to the upside. Can't expect that. So you never sell when the market is in a consolidation. You never take setups. You never trade when the market is in consolidation. So this is a basic market structure video. I hope it helped you guys. Um, if you haven't, like and subscribe and i will have more videos coming out as soon as possible i appreciate y'all guys thanks may y'all continue just supporting me i thank y'all